I mean, you've seen all these successful channels. What do they do? Well, the short answer is it's not rocket science. Channels like this one here, or this one, this one, and even this one, which is huge, well, they don't have a face. All these channels are faceless channels, and some of them get $1.2,000 per month. Some of them get 4K, but some of them get $25,000 per month. Now, I don't want to say to you that it's going to be easy, that it's going to be some get-rich-quick scheme. You can live in Dubai the next month. You can't, but I still stand by what I said. It's not rocket science. All these people are actually doing, first of all, they've got tools. And second of all, they're consistent. Consistency part, well, you got to do it on your own. You simply have to show up every day over a longer period of time. But the first part, the tool that you would need, well, that'll solve half of your problems. And I've got something for you. It's called Wondershare and it's called Verbo. So it's Wondershare's Verbo. You can click the link down there and it's basically all in one tool that can help every content creator out there. So now I'll just show you step by step how to use Verbo in order to create a faceless channel for yourself and of course make money from it. But just have this in mind, if they could do it, you can do it. Period. First things first, of course, create yourself a YouTube channel. You can do it as well with Instagram, TikTok, whichever platform of choice. Choose a niche. For this example, I'll just use history. Now, just do what all the other people are doing. Create yourself a name. ChatGPT is always going to be good for that. Get yourself a logo. Canva.com, always good for that. Recreate what your competitors are doing. Click on more. See the description. Again, use ChatGPT for it. Put all your links. And then, of course, the most important phase, do the research. Once more, take a look at your competition. Watch some videos. Now, one thing that you would have to do on your own is to find the trending topics this way by doing the research and just seeing what kind of videos perform well on their channels. For example, if they are into World War One or... This person is an age of discovery or maybe World War II or maybe some regions or something like that. And it's not hard. Just take a look at the views, right? So just base yourself around those topics. You can even go down there and recreate the topics that you saw perform well. For example, like this here. This is a very good example. And then, of course, you come to Verbo, Wondershare, Verbo, and then just click on Start Online for free. You can click the link down there right now and you can create yourself an account, answer some of these questions. Of course, for you is going to be social media content. Click on submit and here is your dashboard. First of all, you get a free gift. It is two free minutes of credits. Click and get started. And this is it here. AI tools. Click on more Then from here go over to text to speech. When you click on that, you've got a beautiful new function here, which is called AI script. You click on that and then all you have to do is to follow this example here. Firstly, put a subject, as in this case, for example, professional financial planner. And then that subject is going to talk about what you need. And then here, you've also got a few commands. What are you want to shorten, expand, change the tone, etc. Now, do keep in mind that AI script is catered more for products. For example, if you want to deal with affiliate marketing or you sell something via e-commerce. For history channel, well, you can just use your friend again. Then go back to Wondershare Verbo, click on create avatar video because you can have a presenter and you don't have to show yourself. And here for the voiceover, this is the first place. So here you paste whatever you want to say, the entire script. And right out of the bat, this interface is really good for me because it reminds me a lot of canva.com because you have similar functions here and similar possibilities, but it's for video, right? It's for your AI video generation. So it's far more better. So this here is the place for your script. And this here, if you click on it, this is where you choose the voiceover. There's a lot of languages as well. So it's not only in English, right? All you got to do is to choose your language, choose the gender here. You can choose the scenes as well. And one more good thing is that you can insert pauses here under features. So let's just choose this one, select. I'll put in some script here and have a look at this. You can change the backgrounds, right? This is so cool because if I click on this here, you can see that my avatar is now in some living room, right? Of course, you can resize your presenter. I always like to keep it like this, you know, it helps. And of course, you can edit all you want inside of this 
timeline, right? Now, of course, you don't have to have a background all the time. You can just hop over to AI generation in here. You can just generate videos, audio. And because my script is something about Roman Empire, I'll just type in like old Roman city like this. And I just click on generate video and we get something like this. You can play it right here. And as you can see, I'm actually pretty amazed how good this is for a history channel. You know, the style is good for this kind of story. And here you just click on use. You can, of course, download the video and then you proceed doing that for the entire script. You don't have to use only these videos, but you saw they're pretty, pretty good. The other option is to use the import button here. You can put in whatever you want for your B-roll and then you can edit all of that inside of this. And of course, all the editing and styles and videos you can get based on what you've seen other people do because just learn from them. There's a lot to learn from people who are here before you, right? And this tool will take care of the rest. You can change this as well. The subtitles or captions, there's features up here. You can change avatars features here. And if you don't like your avatar, just click here on the avatar button. And there's a lot of these. There's 4K ones. There's some with static backgrounds. Then there's like these on a plain white background. And honestly, there's plenty of these, just way too many. Here's the option to add some text. You can even add some stickers and of course music. Music is here. When you're done with it, just click on the export button, which is located here. And of course, when it's done, you upload it to your channel. Here's a part of the video that I've created for Suppose History Channel, so I can just show you how it looks like. So yeah, here it is. Rome boasts a history spanning over 2,700 years. Founded in 753 BCE by the twin brothers Romulus and Remus, it grew from a small settlement on the banks of the Tiber River into one of the greatest empires in history. But as I've told you, you have to be consistent. You have to show up. If you plan to upload, I don't know, four times a week, do it. Also, it's okay to upload one or two per week, for starters. And over time, you will start getting that YouTube ad money. Later on, you can work with sponsors or maybe some affiliate marketing, right? That's an option as well down the road. Now, when it comes to the pricing, there's a monthly plan with 19.9 per month. There's yearly one, which I highly recommend because you just save a lot. And then there's this one, yearly plan pro. But of course, you can always see all the features down there on the website. What do you get with each one of these? The link is down there. Click on it. Have a look. And yeah, wish you good luck.